I'm Janet Wiley Lambert. I graduated in 1986. And Shelley LaForce Hartman, I graduated in 1985. We roomed together when I was a senior and Janet was a junior. Yeah, we lived um, on the same hall in Aikens um, the year before, and then we decided to live together um, that year, 1985. 84-85. Yep. <laughs> we had a project house. Well, I was a cheerleader for basketball for all four years, so going into my senior year, um, we had a championship basketball team, but nobody came to watch us, so I pitched a project as sports awareness because my theory was that nobody knew when the events were, that if we made them aware of them and we did promos for each sport, that we would have better attendance, and they loved it, and so 10 of us lived in 312 University Avenue and did posters every week to... Uh, yeah, different sports like yeah. soccer, and they actually had rest. I don't know if they saw wrestling, um, field hockey, all that kind of stuff. We would like... Girls and boys basketball, We would say, football. free donuts, or free this, free that. And we'd have footballs to throw in the stand, you know, just do a promo for a game, you know, like their big game every season, so swimming, diving. And do you think that it made an impact? I think so. I think so too. Cheer, I mean, from the games that we went to, it seemed to. Yeah, it was fun. Yeah, I don't know if it, I don't, I, I don't, don't think, I think it fell by the wayside after we did it. I don't think anybody it. picked it up after we did it, but it worked great for us. Yeah, we really enjoyed the experience of living in a house and, you know. With 10 of us, yeah. Yeah, made a, you know, made us even closer and all that kind of stuff. We even had a kitchen and, Oh, and we actually had a payphone. I have a picture of somebody on yeah, our payphone. Pay <laughs> There's a payphone in the kitchen. Like, it's just so funny. So, Four years ago, five of us went up to Cape Cod for a week, uh, long weekend to celebrate our 50th birthdays. So, yeah. But we just got together a couple weeks ago in Bethlehem, Pennsylvania, because that's kind of a middle grounds for all of us. So the four of us got together. And yeah, our other friend lives in Colorado, so we FaceTimed her. But Shelly and I are the steadfast ones that come all the time, so. Yeah. My daughter's also a junior here right now, so. Another reason to come back a lot. <laughs> I don't want her to leave, so but whatever. Um, and my parents also went to Susquehanna. They graduated in 1956 and 1953. And my mom was went to Susquehanna as well. Yes, yes. Did you work in the cafeteria? I worked in the cafeteria. Yeah, we worked in the cafeteria. Back in the day, They, uh, I was known as the ice cream girl because only once a week they had ice cream. So I had to like set up the machine or, or uh, they had soft ice cream, but then they also had the hard ice cream. So like people, like it's crazy to think back of what, what we, you know, what they have now versus what we had then. I mean, that was the only place that you could eat. Yeah, so, like, right. You had the no only choice. option. Yeah, we had a snack bar, but it had limited hours and limited yeah, food. Yeah, it was like Crusader and, Castle, the snack bar yeah. was. <laughs> and Tina, who still works in the cafeteria, yes. we both worked with her. And I yeah, worked Tina Landis. She works in the cafe. Yeah. So every time I see, every time I come up, I'm we always, yeah. And I worked at the switchboard, which is really funny because we had one um, phone for the floor that was in campus line and one payphone. So if somebody would, if her mom would call the switchboard and then say Janet, Lan Janet Wiley, Aikens, whatever, extension, then I would connect them. So there's actually a switchboard, wow. yeah. So that was interesting. We have friends that graduated, I have friends that graduated in 83, so. Okay. Yeah, my daughter, meeting up with them and her daughter's here, so. Yeah, so. Not that if she wasn't here, I wouldn't be here, but. Yeah. but it's not a reunion here for us, but we just yeah. thought we would come. It's an awesome place. Yeah, enjoy your, enjoy your time here because, you know. Yeah, it goes really fast and. Uh, one of my favorite things to say too is like make memories not on your phone, like make memories in your head too, because like not everything, you know, has to be on your phone. <laughs> we didn't have that and look at our friendship and our memories, but it's, you know, the four best years of your life for a lot of people and make lifelong friends. Mm -hmm.